Since more than 40,000 years ago, fishing has been a widely preferred pastime. But today, some fishermen are out there sports fishing for glory. Despite the fact that many still use this ancient technique as a source of sustenance and others view it as more of a leisurely pleasure. Consequently, the question arises. Have you ever wondered what the largest fish ever caught looked like? Respectfully, we wouldn't hold it against you if you didn't realize how magnificent these creatures actually were. So, to set your thoughts right, these are the 20 biggest catches of all time. Number 20. World's Largest Stingray According to GWR, this fish was captured by a fisherman on June 20th, 2022, in the Stung Trang area of northern Cambodia. Scientists feel the animal is a good development for the river, which is endangered by human encroachment and development, damming, and climate change, according to a statement from the fisheries and environmental consulting business, Fishbio. Guinness World Records has now determined that the 13-foot-long, 661-pound stingray discovered in Cambodia's Mekong River earlier this month is the largest freshwater fish in the world, GWR. 33-year-old Jack Eschenroder, a researcher who assisted in measuring the stingray called the discovery surreal. The measurement of the stingray left onlookers speechless. Large enough to be considered the moment when fishermen captures what no one was supposed to see. With a foot of wings on each side of 30 centimeters, the amazing fish, also known as a whip ray, typically measured 2.2 meters, 7 feet 2 inches, or the length of two ping pong tables. The record-breaking ray, according to GWR, is a member of an endangered species. Its name, Barami, which translates to full moon in Khmer, was given in honor of both her rounded disc-like shape and its early evening release period. Despite the fact that the findings were made by locals, the measurements were conducted by a group of international ichiologists. As a part of the U.S. Cambodian Wonders of the Mekong project in collaboration with the Cambodian Fisheries Administration, before we begin, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. And that takes us to today's video's strange topic. According to a Daily Mail article, a fisherman in the African waters snagged this 20-foot-long shark that measured 2,000 kilograms. According to reports, the fisherman struggled for more than an hour to reel an enormous sea monster in. The shark was captured on a scheduled fishing excursion by a fisherman named Kwame Kojo, 67, a South African. And after that stunning triumph, he asserted that the enormous fish was then cautiously returned to the wild. Let us know what you think about this big catch in the comment section with the hashtag strange topic. That being said, let's move on. Number 19. The World Record Black Marlin have you ever wondered how huge marlin actually gets while scrolling through a gallery of images? Every angler aspires to that trophy cache, but every so often, a fish is caught that absolutely shatters all previous records. Although greater marlin has been caught illegally by leisure and commercial fishermen, the following video shows the largest marlin that has ever been caught. These are the black, striped, white, blue, both the Atlantic and Pacific, and all tackle world records. The size of these marlins serves as the gold standard for fishermen searching for the biggest fish on the entire planet. Alfred Glassell Jr. secured one of the biggest catches in the history of sport fishing on August 4, 1953. In line with IGFA regulations, the largest marlin ever caught on a rod and reel was captured in Cabo Blanco, Peru, on the Sterling Stewart Captain vessel Patrell. The catch that set a world record weighed 1,560 pounds, was 14 feet 6 inches long, and had 6 feet 9 inch circumference. After an hour and 45 minute battle, Glassell caught the record black marlin while trolling a cerro mackerel as bait. He employed a size 12-0 fin nor reel and 39 thread ashway line on a tycoon rod. Number 18. World Record Paddlefish Caught at Oklahoma Lake According to a Facebook post from the Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation, this paddlefish set a world record and was reportedly found in Oklahoma on July 2021. The 164-pound fish was snagged by Grant Raider of Wichita, Kansas at Keystone Lake close to Tulsa. The ODWC posted that Raider had made a fantastic capture, noting that the beast weighed 164 pounds. 
According to the ODWC, Raider received assistance with his world record catch from Jeremiah Mefford of Real Good Time Guide Service. Corey Waters, a former state and world record holder from Orshalata, Oklahoma, also visited the lake to congratulate Raider on his achievement. The previous benchmark was 151.9 pounds set by Waters. The paddlefish, which can live up to 50 years, is one of the state's most unusual fish according to the ODWC. The Gran Neosho and Arkansas River systems are home to the majority of the ancient fish, which are also found in Montana and Louisiana. Number 17. Massive World Record Size Hammerhead Shark Recently, Greg Norman had a fantastic day on the water. In his prime, the shark amassed 20 PGA Tour victories, 14 victories on the European Tour, and two Open Championship victories. Although he's an Australian native, he has lived in Florida for at least as long as he has in his native country. Florida and Australia are essentially two of the most well-liked fishing spots on the planet, which is why I brought this up. Greg Norman spends most of his time fishing away from the golf field. The only reason Norman earned the nickname The Shark was due to his playing style on the golf course, not because he was particularly good at catching fish. But these days, he unquestionably lives up to the nickname's more literal interpretation. Greg Norman recently caught and released a massive hammered shark with Josh from Black Tip, the most popular fishing channel on YouTube. That was longer than the previous IGFA hammerhead fishing world record. Because it's a protected species, they did not weigh this shark before releasing it back into the water. But this huge hammerhead measured an absurd 175 inches, 14 feet and 7 inches. Number 16. Biggest Bluefin Tuna Fishing Record Ken Fraser's bluefin is not only the largest tuna the International Game Fish Association has ever recorded, but it's also one of the most famous records ever. On October 26, 1979, while fishing with Captain Eric Sampson aboard Lady and Misty out of Port Hood, Nova Scotia, caught the bluefin tuna that set the world record. And get this, after the largest tuna ever caught consumed a toad mackerel, Fraser required just 45 minutes to bring it within striking distance. The bluefin tuna was dehydrated in the boat for almost 10 hours, but it still weighed a staggering 1,496 pounds. We may never see this world record tuna beaten because it has been standing for nearly 50 years. Off the coasts of Maine and Louisiana, huge bluefin tuna have recently been caught as well, but not to compare with the leading world record. Number 15. Fisherman Catches New Record Brown Trout Even though Montana is known for having excellent trout fishing, the state's reputation was elevated when a fisherman caught a brown trout that set a new state record. Robbie Doctor snagged, battled, and successfully landed a 32.43 pound brown trout while fishing the Marius River. His fish was confirmed as the new state record by Montana Fish, Wildlife, and Parks. The previous state record for brown trout, which E. H. Peck Bacon set in 1966, is broken by Doctor's capture. The 29-pound record catch for Bacon came from Wade Lake. They were largely a hunting family, but they also enjoyed fishing when hunting seasons were over. They usually go for trout and walleye fishing after dark. But Doctor found himself concentrating on larger fish that feed nearby since he had always wanted to catch a 10-pound brown. So he made the decision to cast a 3 8 ounce Castmaster brown trout spoon on a 6 foot shield's ultralight rod, loaded with Berkeley Trilene 4 pound test. He realized the fish was large when it struck. Since the 4 pound test was strong enough to land a large fish, he wasn't concerned about breaking it off. Rather, he was more concerned about the trebles lining up straight. He struggled as he moved his catch closer to land, and it was already dark by the time it was finished. He turned on his headlamp, and when the light hit his back and head, he realized they wouldn't be able to catch him in the net. To ensure that it was captured on camera, they took numerous photos beside the river, after which they had to travel quite a distance to get reception. When they received a signal, his daughter checked the state record and discovered that it was a 29-pound fish captured in 1966. The weight of their catch, however, was proven to be 32.43 pounds. Doctor then made the decision to donate the carcass to FWP for research and have a skin mount produced. Both he and everyone else are interested in the fish's age. Additionally, it will be intriguing to see how the research turns out. Number 14. New Record Pike in the Netherlands 
the previous BNRZ record for pike, a fish that Nico Mulkins caught in March 2017 and measured 134 centimeters long, was just broken and increased by a stunning 4 centimeters. The official Dutch record pike has now grown to 138 centimeters. Siegfried Schon holds the new record. Siegfried is a German that lives in Belgium but does most of his fishing in the Netherlands. The enormous pike caught his lure on October 2019 with an unmatched thwack. The rod holder suddenly turned over, but Siegfried maintained his composure and, after a good struggle, managed to net the fish. Siegfried was congratulated on his new Dutch record catch, Pike, after carefully examining the images of the fish on the measuring board. You can see that this record-breaking fish has risen to the top of the beat Dutch freshwater species list. The BNRZ is run by the editorial staff of Beat Sportivisers, magazine in collaboration. Together, they make up the committee that reviews fishermen's claims for new records. Siegfried had to snap a panorama of the measuring board because of how long the pike was. Siegfried's catch quickly gained notoriety as he released the huge pike and posted pictures on his Instagram page. A brief video about this once-in-a-lifetime capture is also available on his page. Number 13. 757-pound swordfish caught near Florida Keys Unaware that he was about to make the catch of a lifetime, Captain Nick Stanzik took a party of clients out on his charter boat in March 2019. He took them to a spot famed for swordfish sightings off the coast of Isla Morada, Florida. Stanzik saw they got a bite about 10 minutes after he set the bait. He was initially ignorant of the size of the fish. He estimated that the electric blue swordfish weighed about 400 pounds after having his first glance at it after about 40 minutes. The beast would repeatedly dive to great depths and then roar back to the surface during the following few hours, but it never managed to escape the line. The crew only got their first real look at the beast after waiting for 5 hours, at which point they concluded it probably weighed more than 600 pounds. The swordfish then started to charge the boat. Stanzik helped his clients stay focused so they could continue to hook fish. Stanzik and his clients, Bill and Debbie Lucier, were eventually able to harpoon the giant and use a pulley to carry it onto the boat after an 8 hour ordeal. By that time, the conflict had set the car 20 miles off course from where it had started. It took 7 people to remove the fish from the boat after they reached land, but it was worthwhile in the end. According to the Miami Herald, the fish weighed an astounding 757.8 pounds, setting both a personal record for Stanzik and a new Florida record. He prepared some swordfish steaks on the barbecue to celebrate. They had lots of leftovers, so hopefully his family enjoyed it too. Number 12. Giant Manta Ray Two enormous manta rays, one weighing 750 kilograms and the other one 250 kilograms, were caught by a fisherman on October 20th, 2020, while he was deep sea fishing off the coast of Mangaluru. On that day, the fisherman Subash Sailan boarded his boat, the Nagasidi. A crane had to be sent in to load them into a pickup truck after he got back to land. Locals came to the port area to see the enormous fish after the massive capture caught in their attention. On social media and in private message groups, similar images and videos have gone viral as well. Former president of the Fishermen's Association in coastal Karanaktaka, Yathish by Kampati, told TNM this enormous catch is neither too common nor too rare. Although they can range in size, they are often captured. Not in a remote location where it wouldn't be recorded, but in Maple, this occurred. However, it has gained popularity as a result of sizable crowd in Maple and social media. The fish will be exported and is anticipated to bring in a sizable profit. After deep sea fishing had restarted following the lockdown, this was also the first such substantial haul at the port of Maple. The gigantic manta ray is in danger, according to NOAA Fisheries, a federal body in the United States in charge of managing the country's marine sources. With a wingspan above to 29 feet, the huge manta ray is the biggest ray in the world. World. They consume lots of zooplankton and are filter feeders. The world's population of giant manta rays is unevenly distributed, has a small, highly fragmented population, and grows slowly. Commercial fishing poses the biggest threat to giant manta rays since it targets the species and also captures it as a bycatch throughout its range, according to NOAA. Number 11. Blue, Marlin World Cup 2021 winning fish. 
The Cape Verde-based 43 Riviera Blue Hunter won the 2021 Cup Blue Marlin Championship by catching a larger blue marlin weighing 1,046.1 pounds. The team was captained by Manuel Viana, who was making his second season-long grander. Marlin World Cup. That fish is worth a shitload of money. On the rod was Tavira, Portugal resident Manuel Rodriguez. 492k was awarded to Blue Hunter for the catch. The tournament saw no other qualifying fish caught. Blue Hunter was regrettably not entered into the Big Blue Challenge, and no other competitor boated a qualifying fish. Blue Hunter reported another hookup just before noon after releasing a marginal fish early in the morning. Before it eventually gaffed, the eventual championship was the leader 20 times. Because the blue was so big, it was impossible to measure it precisely and because its tail protruded past the transom. The team was still required to wait for the official outcome even after a two hour run back to port. It took some time to get a crane operator to unload the enormous catch because it was Sunday afternoon. The winning blue measured 142 inches from the lower jaw to the tail fork and 73 inches in circumference. Number 10. Fisherman catches impossibly large 280 pound catfish. A professional angler appeared to have caught an impossibly enormous catfish while fishing in the Po River in Italy, which is more reasons to never enter large bodies of water. According to CNN's Greg Bohatello and Joseph Netto, angler Dino Ferrari, who is sponsored by Sportex, recently caught a 280-pound Welsh catfish using only a light tackle spinning reel, with pictures of Ferrari posing with the absurdly huge fish appearing online. It's understandable that many would wonder whether the couch-sized fish is a prank or something that people should be constantly terrified of. Ferrari is a catch-and-release fisherman, thus, it's difficult to establish the presence of the fish because he released his catch after bringing it in for weighing. What is certain is that the Wells catfish can weigh up to 300 pounds, is essentially a mutant form of the American catfish. The greatest catch ever recorded in Italy weighed 298 pounds. This enormous type of catfish has been seen lifting its body out of the water in an insane attempt to swallow pigeons and other small animals that are nibbling on the riverbank. Again, stay away from lakes, rivers, and oceans at all costs. Ferrari is keeping the location of his wonder fishing place a secret. He can't have old Santiago blowing up his place. He acknowledged that it took him 40 lengthy minutes to reel the fish to land where he held it for a half an hour. Number 9. Monster Bull Shark from the Deep Many scientists agree that bull sharks are the most dangerous sharks in the world. This is due to the fact that these sharks are aggressive in nature and prefer to prey on tropical shorelines where people frequently go swimming. But they're not just the most dangerous. This adorable species can appear to be troublesome sometimes and truly doesn't have humans as part of its diet. Josh and the lad set out to catch some amberjacks and have some fun in this episode of Black Tip H. But each amberjack they caught was devoured by a large shark, a bull shark to be exact. Josh eventually lost his cool and threw a shark catching bait into the water. He eventually hooked the huge shark after a brief interval. It was an odd and most definitely not easy battle. Then, following a 20 minute struggle, a huge bull shark surfaced. Josh just so happened to have caught this biggest bull shark to date, setting a new personal record. The shark's weight was roughly 600 pounds, and the shark was released just like all the Black Tip H episodes. Number 8 giant squid caught off the coast of Japan. Another enormous squid has been caught by Japanese fishermen using their nets. The length of the squid, including its tentacles, was 5.8 meters. It was the fourth enormous squid that fishermen in the Toyana Prefecture, central Japan, had successfully caught in their nets in 2015. According to WPTV.com, this catch was the first one that many of the fishermen had seen alive. In the last year or two, local fishermen have noted a troubling increase in huge squid catches. They claim that as they drag their shrimp nets out to a depth of about 300 meters, Meters, the squid is getting closer to the surface and into them. And based on what little is known about giant squid, their maximum height is 300 meters. They favor levels between 600 and 1800 meters. A local curator informed the Japan News in 2013 that only eight specimens had been identified in 50 years up to 2014. Then, eight were discovered in 2014 just off the coast of Niigata Prefecture, and several more in Toyama Prefecture. The most recent catch, according to a spokeswoman for the Toyama Prefecture Aquarium, will be maintained for scientific study. Number 7. Strongest Women vs. Strongest Fish 
Josh went fishing with three of the world's toughest women in this episode of Black Tip H, and they tried to take on one of the ocean's toughest fish. Stephanie Cohen, one of the all-time greatest female powerlifters, Sarah Backman, an eight-time world champion arm wrestler, and Kristen Nunn, a fitness and social media celebrity, were among his visitors, and they intended to use the stand-up tackle to capture enormous goliath groupers. The three women quickly realized just how strong these marine creatures were. However, each woman was able to reel in a catch after a few tips and a little teamwork. The women agreed that the experience they had was nothing in comparison to arm wrestling or weightlifting, and the expressions on their faces clearly conveyed what they meant by that. Number 6. The Biggest Arapaima Caught by Jeremy Wade One of the biggest freshwater fish in the world is the Arapaima. An adult Arapaima can grow to a length of 10 feet or more and weigh up to 440 pounds. A specimen that is 8 feet or longer and weighs at least 220 pounds, long specimens of up to 6.5 feet are not unusual, and Jeremy caught a fish that was considerably larger than this. Uh, right, gotta be out. On River Monsters Extreme Angler, Jeremy Wade has been up close and personal with some of the ugliest, fiercest, and occasionally most hazardous species for eight reasons. Wade explores the world in the Enduring Animal Planet series, pursuing legends and mythology that emerged from remote locales like Central India, the Amazon, and Greenland, in order to find aquatic creatures that have infrequently, if ever, seen the light of day. And Jeremy Wade tried yet again to catch this fish on video in the first episode of Jungle Hooks which was produced in 2002. He finally employed local methods to bring in a 200-pound specimen after overcoming numerous setbacks, including almost dying in an aircraft crash. Although some sources claim the Arapaima can reach a length of 15 feet, the average weight given by these sources is still 440 pounds. These allegations are probably untrue because Jeremy calculated that a 15-foot Arapaima would weigh about 2,000 pounds in his book. Number 5. Tiger Shark Caught Off Seven Mile Beach in Australia I bet you thought it was safe to return to the water. Well, rethink it. Apparently, after being brought onto a fishing boat off the coast of Australia over the weekend, a massive 6 meter tiger shark's body had its jaw removed to be retained as a trophy. Jeff Brooks said the 6 meter apex predator was caught off Seven Mile Beach, near Lennox Head on the northern New South Wales coast at some point in August 2015 in a Facebook post with two photographs of the shark. After learning that the shark may have been ensnared in nets under the Lennox Head region, Mr. Brooks said he was unable to establish whether the marine predator was intentionally murdered. The big shark was reportedly retrieved from the ocean off Tweed Heads by a fisherman named Matthew, who even kept the shark's jaws as a memento. Number 4. Giant Snakehead the giant snakehead is a ferocious fighter that is valued in Southeast Asia as a sport fish that is also delicious. The massive, strong jaws are lined with pointed teeth. Any freshwater habitat, including ponds, lakes, reservoirs, swamps, streams, and drains, can be easily adapted by this species. In a vegetation filled nest that has sunk close to the coast, eggs are placed. The parents ferociously defend their young. When fully developed, specimens can seriously hurt anyone who unintentionally approaches the nest or poses a threat to their offspring. But with this enormous 30 pound fish, Malaysian angler Faisal Zainal may have broken the all tackle world record for huge snakehead on February 28, 2018, when fishing outside of Rawang. After the snakehead destroyed the lure he was casting, Zainal just needed a short while to subdue it. If accepted, the catch will take the place of the current 26-pound all-tackle world record. Number 3. Peyton Moore's 300-pound Alligator Gar On May 20, 2022, the inhabitant of Sugarland ventured out on a boat down a Houston swamp, determined to catch one of the largest alligator gars Texas may have ever seen. Unofficially, he succeeded in doing just that by hooking a huge alligator gar that measured more than 8 feet long and weighed more than 300 pounds. For the sake of the enormous fish, Moore, 32, chose not to reveal the name of the bayou, but the full-time YouTuber still managed to record the catch and upload it to his channel. Moore initially believed he may have hooked a tree branch when he set his reel in position, but the other end of his wire was immobile, and he immediately knew he had discovered a gigantic fish as soon as it began to move. 
He had to fire exhaust the fish because it was too strong to will in at the full strength. In an effort to confuse it, he purposefully made it swim in circles and repeatedly changed its course. Moore waited for the right moment, then lassoed the gar and slung it over his pectoral fins. Moore claims that the fish weighed well over 300 pounds because of its enormous length of 8 feet 2 inches and girth of 48 inches. The capture might have exceeded the official state record of 302 pounds, established in 1953, but sadly it didn't meet the requirements. Number 2. Missouri Bow Fisherman Shoots Potential World Record Big Head Carp On July 24th, Matt Newling successfully arrowed and caught a big head carp with a state and world record size. The Missouri Department of Conservation MDC, has recognized the 125-pound 5-ounce behemoth as the biggest big head ever harvested in Missouri, and as an official state record in the area of alternative methods. It may also break the world record for big heads caught with a bow, which now belongs to William Barr's 104-pound catch in West Virginia in 2020. According to the Bow Fishing Association of America, it took a crew to catch the carp. His companion was able to reel in his arrow and send it to the writhing big head after realizing that Newling was bound to a monster. The carp had to be dragged onto the shore by the two of them. The big head was given to MDC Fisheries Program Specialist Andrew Branson after Newling, and his friend had the fish weighed on a certified scale. Branson calculated that the big head was over 10 years old. Big head carp are an invasive species from Asia. An invasive species can thrive if given a chance, as evidenced by this particular fish. But whether it's invasive or not, the fish is a genuine giant. Number 1. Great White Shark Tracked Off Jersey Shore A massive great white shark making its way up to the Atlantic coast recently paid the Jersey Shore an early visit as Memorial Day weekend approaches for beachgoers. On April 28, 2022, off the coast of New Jersey, Ironbound, one of the numerous sharks being monitored by the nonprofit research group OSEARCH sent a ping. The West Ironbound Island in Nova Scotia is the name of the tagged shark, which is 12 feet 4 inches long and weighs approximately 998 pounds. OSEARCH, one of the top organizations in the world for shark research, tags and tracks the movements of sharks on its expeditions using a data-centric methodology. Since its inaugural expedition in 2007, OSEARCH has approximately 200 scientists on staff and has tagged more than 400 species. The group seeks to increase our understanding of shark biology and behavior in order to advance better marine regulations. Every year, during the summer, great white sharks go north to feed around Nova Scotia in an effort to regain their weight after the mating season in the southern Atlantic. Ironbound is not the biggest shark that OSEARCH has ever observed. Ironbound is, according to Hooter, around 20 years old, and it's a known fact that great white sharks typically reach the age of 60. And that concludes today's video on the 20 biggest catches of all time. Let us know in the comment section which one of these catches you found amazing. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now. See you next time.